Um, what kind of financial controls would you suggest to business owners that they should pl place in, in, into action for their businesses to help them, give them a step up on succeeding? Okay. Boy, I, I would just say good ones, but you probably want more detail than that. <laughs> yes, a um, bit more. One of the things that I think is really important is um, Quicken and a lot of the, the smaller online, or not online, but the computer related things can give you a really quick and accurate picture of how am I doing on a profitability standpoint. Um, but what I frequently see and, and something I, I like to counsel people of is I'd like to see a interim financial statement or interim is a year to date. In other words, um, your year end might be December but in June or July or August you'll give me an eight month year to date statement. I want to see a year to date statement that's using the same accounting principles as what your year end statement is going to be that your accountant's going to be putting together. So the same things that you go at the end of the year and expense out or do your adjustments on, I like to see those things part way through the year. So basically actively managing your financials. One is actively managing it, knowing what it is, and two is accurately tracking it so that we don't have a financial statement in August that says I'm making a $90,000 a year profit, and then we get to December, and after we've adjusted it to, to fit with normal accounting practices, I'm down to a $24,000 profit. Okay. Great, Clayton. That was very informative.